Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have the Kerry Kit XL Joy and the Lily Jade Large Anna. So lately I have had a few questions about the difference between the two and whether I like one more than the other. So I thought, why not make a video and just have a close look at both bags and its features? So the one obvious main difference between the two is my Kerry Kit XL Joy is made in full grain leather. It's smooth. It's not pebbly at all, but it is super soft at the same time. So let me show you a close look of the leather. Really pretty. And the hardware is in a muted gold color. It's not overly yellow. And my Lily Jade Large Anna is made in the nylon. And the hardware is in silver. Really pretty also. And their grab handle, zipper pulls, and backpack strap is all in full grain leather. Now, Lily J does have leather options as well in this style bag. Both bags have feet on them and they are matching to their hardware. Now, the Kerry Kit XL Joy, the studs are flat. Let me try and show you a close up. So, as you can see, it is flat and it's not um, rounded at all. It's still at a very nice height to keep the bag off the ground and nice and protected. Whereas the Lily Jade feet is rounded. So as you can see there, it also sticks out at a really nice height. Both of these bags are backpacks. One of the main differences would be that the Lily Jade backpack straps is detachable at the bottom as so, and you can tuck it into the back slip pocket and you can do the same to the other side and then attach a strap that this bag actually comes with and you can attach it to the D-rings on the side and you can wear this crossbody or over the shoulder. Whereas the Carry Kit XL Joy, the straps are not removable in any way, but the straps are really nicely padded and they're super comfortable. This bag also comes with D-rings the same as the large Anna, so you are able to attach the strap if that's your kind of thing to wear this kind of bag over the shoulder and messenger style. But to me, I think this bag looks gorgeous as a backpack and I probably wouldn't carry it any other way. I do like that the XL Joy has D-rings on the side so I can attach stroller hooks and I can pop this bag on the stroller. So the strap on the large Anna, it's just like a lot of the other bags but maybe slightly wider. Um, I haven't actually done a comparison of the actual strap, but from what I remember, it looks like it's a tad wider, which is nice because it is a bigger bag. So the wider straps should make it a little bit more comfortable to wear. So when I pop these bags side by side, they look like they're about the same width. Now, because they're completely different bags, they're obviously going to fit more things in other areas because they have different pockets but just by eye it looks like the large anna is slightly wider and slightly taller the one thing that a lot of people love about the large anna and just the anna style in general is that it has the two compartments so you have a compartment at the front where the zips go halfway down and then you have another one that goes all the way to the bottom and it opens up like a suitcase Whereas the Joy only has the one compartment, just like what you find in a lot of bags. Both bags have D-rings, like I mentioned earlier. They both have really nice hardware. So the side pockets, the Lily Jade is really nice and spacious. It doesn't have any elastic at top for it to bounce back. It doesn't have any magnets. It's just nice and open. So I have a water bottle here from Macca's and that fits easily with room to spare, like about two fingers. And I also have a can of Coke and that fits nicely. And the Joy has a elastic top. It's also insulated which is really nice whereas the lily jade one is not so this is what the water bottle looks like inside the joy and then a can of coke and there you go out of the two pockets personally i like the joy better because i like that the elastic is there so it keeps everything nice and snug when it's empty it does not bounce back all the way to the the bag here 
there is still a gap like the lily jade but i think when you pop something in it it kind of hugs it tight and i feel like it keeps things in there a little bit more secure that's just personal preference so let's have a look at the front pockets that these bags offer so on the large anna you have a really nice size pocket that goes all the way to the bottom and to the side of the bag and the joy has one at the front as well that goes from there to there and to the bottom of the bag so it looks like the large anna one is taller behind the front pocket on the joy is the mummy pocket where it offers some internal organization so you have one two three four card slots two pen holders and another slip pocket with a elastic top as well it's also very spacious it goes all the way to the bottom bag and about that wide behind the front pocket on the large anna you have this beautiful pocket that's nice and hidden so unless someone is like fully staring at your bag i don't think they will be able to notice that that's even a pocket because you cannot see the zip at all and it goes all the way to the bottom of the bag and about that wide so both of the large anna front pockets do not have internal organization the xl joy also has a nice top pocket here which is to me kind of like a little secret sort of pocket which i really like because sometimes i like to hide things in there from my kids they always seem to notice all the other pockets but this one at the top i mean it's not like it's you know like the hardware is a different color or anything it still sticks out but they just don't seem to look in here for anything anyway so this is a great spot for me to keep my like headphones or my phone charger something small even like hair ties or a little pouch with all my bobby pins so i love this pocket because i like to keep things that i don't want my kids to get into but it's small enough for me to keep all the bits and bods that i seem to lose and i need quick access to so at the back of both bags, let's have a look at their pockets. So on the left hand side on the Joy, you have a hidden pocket here. It has a zip top closure. As you can see, it's lined with the same lining that you get inside the bag. Now it goes to about here to the bag and it goes to the bottom of the bag and it stops up to here to the top of the bag. Now, I hope that kind of makes sense because <laughs> sometimes I, I kind of lose my words, but I'm, I'm not very good at describing things, but I hope you guys get the idea. So that is a nice little pocket to keep your phone, your wallet, anything that you need quick access to, but that's not overly large or super thick because you don't really want that hitting against your back. Now, the large Anna has a slip pocket at the back with a clip here. It's not a, like a magnet. It's just a clip. And it's quite wide it goes all the way to the bottom of the bag and it's about that wide the other main difference between the two is the grab handles now the carry kit grab handle it has been rolled together so it's it feels really nice and sturdy and it feels quite soft at the same time i think that you're not going to have any problems with it coming loose or wearing because it's also made out of the same full grain leather now the lily jade strap is also made out of full grain leather which is going to um, last a very long time as well but the design of the strap is a little different so it is um, flat and it looks pretty much the same as the extra strap that comes with it feels pretty much the same um, very comfortable and very sturdy so both really really good quality. okay so this is where the bag's going to start um, being quite different because of the whole two compartment on the large anna and the joy being just one and the internal organization is also very different so we're gonna put the large anna aside and we're just gonna have a close look at the joy first so when you open up the main compartment of the bag at the very back here you have a pocket that has a leather trimming now the zip on this back pocket is plastic so it's not metal hardware like it is on the outside of the bag it's still really nice and it's really smooth all plastic zippers generally are smooth um, it goes to about here to the bag and where the leather trimming ends is how wide the pocket is the zipper pull is also made out of leather sitting on top you have a little clip where you can hook on a pacifier or your keys anything you want really and right in front of this pocket here is a padded sleeve 
now you can put an ipad anything that you want extra protection now i don't use electronics generally besides my phone so in this padded sleeve is where i normally like to pack my nappies and my wipes and change pads so if you're familiar with my packing videos that's something that you're probably aware of anyway that's how i like to pack my carry kit bags now on the side pockets here as you can see they are insulated which is really nice so remember me saying that the outside pockets are insulated so in total the joy has four insulated pockets which is really really nice so on the other side it's exactly the same at the very front of this bag here there are two slip pockets if you can see so it's got an elastic top as well the lining is in a really nice champagne color and it is also water resistant so that's all the internal organization that the joy offers so let's have a look at the large anna so like i mentioned earlier the large anna does have two separate compartments so let's have a look at the front compartment and see what it looks like on the inside so here's a close look of the lining it's in a beautiful jade color i love that all of their bags are light colored on the inside so it makes it really easy for you to find your things inside the front compartment on the front side of this bag there are no pockets at all but sitting at the back here there is a back pocket just like the joy but it doesn't have a leather trimming it's got a plastic zip just like the joy and it's got the leather zipper pull really smooth and it goes all the way to the bottom of the bag and just where the pockets end on the side that's how wide the pocket is i just have my strap sitting in that slip pocket but that's what the strap looks like Sitting in front of that pocket, there is two slip pockets. One, the one at the back is wider and also deeper. The one at the front is smaller, obviously. And sitting in front of that front slip pocket has this really nice leather strip with Lily Jade's name embossed into it, which is really, really pretty. It's a nice little touch. Sorry if the bag looks like it's sitting a little bit awkwardly, but the bag is empty and I have it in the nylon, so it's a little slouchy at the moment. But this is what the back compartment looks like when it's completely empty. So the features inside this section here are two slip pockets with the elastic top and it stretches about the same as the Joy. They're very wide. You can easily fit like a jujube large set piece quite easily in these pockets. There's nothing up here, so it's nice and spacious. On the Little Jade website, they had their bag packed up in one of their photos and it looked like they put a pair of shoes in there. So it is quite a large pocket. And sitting on this side of the bag here, you have a slip pocket that is very large. It is the width of what you see here. And it is nice and padded. Now, I think this is designed to put electronics like in the Joy, on that the Joy had on the inside. But this has a leather strap here, which clips onto this end over here to keep everything staying in place. So I have heard some people say they don't love the way the large Anna opens, just like how they don't love how the GGB Be Right Back opens. But for me personally, I don't mind having that option because I like opening it wide open when I need access to everything inside the bag and I'm just popping the bag on the floor. So that doesn't bother me at all because I think it's a quite a nice feature. But when I'm out and about and I don't have space or I don't feel comfortable popping my bag on the floor like I would say inside a house or somewhere where it's clean, um, this is how I like to open it. So I just unzip the bag about halfway and I'm still able to have access to all the things inside my bag. So the XL Joy from Carry Kit comes with a multi-use bag. This is the larger one. Carry Kit offers two sizes and you can buy these pouches separately. But when you purchase the bags, the bigger bags like the full size Amber and the XL Joy comes with the large size pouch. Now this pouch is water resistant. You can throw it in the wash, the lining of the bag and the pouch is matching. So that's really nice. So if this pouch is too big for you, you are able to purchase an additional pouch on the site and it's about half the size of this large one. So if this something this size is much better for you, you are able to purchase that separately. 
the Lily Jade Large Anna does not come with any pouches but it does come with an additional strap which is really nice it's full grain leather it has matching hardware so it's for you to attach to the d-rings on the side of the bag and you can wear this over the shoulder or crossbody once again guys thank you so much for tuning into my channel i hope you enjoyed this video and i hope you found it helpful and i'd love to see you guys at the next one bye